So now I'm going to show you how to preheat the machine before you roast. So you press the manual mode and what the machine does is that it checks all the mechanically important parts of the machine so that there are no faults before you roast. So if you wait for one minute or two, it, sh it should be able to go into the setting. So now as you can see, you have the menu where you, have, you can control all the temperatures for your preheating. So on the top left, you have the internal temperature and it says the current temperature inside the drum is 34 degrees, it's slowly increasing. And right at the bottom, you have the target temperature. So you can increase or decrease the target temperature according to the specific temperature that you want. And on the right, you have the drum temperature. So the reason why you can control or measure the temperature of the drum is that compared to other roasters where the drum rotates, with the S7 Pro, the drum is actually stationary, so it doesn't actually spin. So the same as the internal temperature, the air temperature inside, you have the temperature of the drum right now, which is 25 degrees, and you have the target temperature of the drum. So you can, again, increase or decrease the target temperature of your drum surface temperature. On the little box here, it's showing you the exhaust temperature of the air and also the air temperature inside the drum. And on the bottom left, you have the settings for the air and the halogen. So it's from 0 to 10 and it increases by 0.5 increments and that goes the same with halogen. So, so now I'm going to go for 7.5 air and 3.5 halogen. So once you set the pre-setting, you can save that by pressing this. And this one, this setting is a bean agitation. So you could control the speed which the beans get agitated inside the drum. So more you agitate, more the beans will be mixing inside the drum. The less you do, less the less the beans will get agitated. So normally you would use higher setting for agitation if you're using more green coffee. But if you're using, let's say, less than 400 grams of green coffee, you'll be using somewhere between four and five. So if you're using more than 400 grams of coffee, then you'll be using somewhere between seven to eight. And you save that and close. And at the top, this is with the little fan um, icon, this is for the cooling. So now I've set all the pre-settings for the preheating. So my target internal temperature is 170 degrees and my target drum, drum temperature is 160 degrees. And my pre-setting for the air is 7.5, the halogen is 3.5 and the bean agitation is 8. So now I'll leave the machines for at least 30 minutes for all my target temperature to be set and then after 30 minutes you're ready to roast. As you can see now all the target temperature has been set and once it's ready the machine will sound an alarm for you to tell you that the machine is ready to roast. Just like that. So now I have 500 grams of Ethiopia Coke honey to roast. So I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into the hopper. And now I can start roasting. So you just press the button start here. And the beans are going into the drum. And I'll explain to you the graph on the screen. <laughs> 